that you're making right now, like you could be in a state of mind right now, but you can make some decisions to adjust that and over the next couple hours, you'll get to a much better place. It's good. So it's time for some coffee break. And this is how you drink coffee, hot coffee in Singapore. Mm. Just be careful, you might burn your tongue. So I'm actually supposed to go dinner with my friends, but they're late. So I can't wait anymore. I'm gonna have some snacks first. Then we will head out to some place for dinner. Best curry puff ever. We have interviewed me. I found out about like when are you meet up? What's up? What's up? What's up? So. Welcome back to the channel. My name is Sabu and I like to make vlogs. Anyway, today's video topic is struggle of being a YouTuber. So yeah, it's almost a month now that yeah, it's almost one month that I've been doing YouTube for full time. And yeah, to be honest, I wouldn't really call myself a YouTuber because I'm not I'm still not making a living out of YouTube but I want to I am stepping making my way towards that but but trust me guys I am actually struggling or maybe I'm just being too too unfair to myself yeah being unfair to myself but here are my thoughts and yeah here's how it goes so like I said, it's been one month and I've only managed to upload 12 videos in total. And yeah, I think I think it's not bad. I mean, considering the fact that, you know, I had a lot of things to do, uh, handing over, you know, moving houses, pack, packing up my things to go back to Myanmar and all of this stuff, right? But yeah, 12 videos, I don't think it's good enough, but it's not too bad but the only thing that is not good things that I want to mention is um I have like you know there's a lot of anxiety and there's a lot of like um, you know pressure building up even though and this channel this channel is like not not there yet there's nothing to be to be pressure about but yeah I'm feeling the pressure al already so yeah within a month I did a lot of part-time jobs because I'm afraid of you know my financial situation because I'm not getting much from YouTube I, I am monetized but yeah not the view doesn't justify you know all the wages and also yeah can't make a living out of YouTube yet so one thing is money so I ended up working a lot more than um, a lot more than what I would have done during my full-time job yeah because I was just scared and I, was, I spent a lot of time doing working part-time and when you work part-time you're actually you know earning by the hour so you're literally working a lot and some of the part-time jobs I've had they are amazing like one hour forty dollar per hour it, those part-time jobs are amazing but some of the part-time jobs I have is just trading time for money which is not really a good thing but yeah uh, by the way I'll, I'll try to put up some of the footages from my $40 $40 per hour job it's pretty simple I had to talk a lot and I have to explain about the products and yeah pretty simple but yeah it's such a good deal
I'm, I'm shifting towards the towards the wrong topic. So I was saying, um, the struggle is that you know when you first start off, you're not getting paid. You know you're not getting money from YouTube itself. So yeah, you you get a little nervous about your financial situation, and you start you know going out, and you you know your aim start to shift you know left and right, which is not a good thing, I believe. But for now, I don't really have a choice but to work a little bit. And that part comes together along with creativity, right? So usually I have the energy, I'll have the energy to go out, uh, plan out where I want to go and talk about the things that I want to talk about. But uh, I think this, especially the last few weeks, uh, like the, the two weeks before that, yeah, I just didn't have the feeling I just didn't have the you know ideas and creativity to even go out you know to even go out there and vlog i couldn't even pick up my camera that's how bad how bad it was i was just scared i don't know why i was it was quite sorry it was quite bad so yeah didn't manage to shoot any of the content i write down a lot though the only positive thing i have to say about the past month is that I have been investing a lot of time in myself which are like um, editing reading and fitness so I've been doing a lot of fitness which is which is I think the only investment that I can do right now investing on my body my health and other than that there's nothing much I, I wanna I wanna escape this I'm trying to escape this way lack of motivation um lack of creativity in the struggle on youtube yes even struggling to put up one vlog or yeah one vlog a day so yeah and it's quite disappointing uh, yeah i'm quite disappointed in myself but yeah i'm trying to figure things out i don't know whether you know i should work less on and really really focus on this because yeah like i said last month i just started out like full-time youtube and i'm like super super scared so yeah i got off track and then started working a lot of of part-time i mean i didn't make a decent amount of money to cover all my expenses in singapore but yeah the main focus is lacking the main goal is lacking and yeah i want to change that i'll try to change that in the next month so this is the first vlog of December it's like 2nd December and probably I'm gonna edit this tomorrow because I'm pre pretty much tired already today I went to work <laughs> part another part-time job for like a hundred and fifty dollars yeah it was as you guys will see later on yeah I was just basically I'll just put up the uh, footages right now uh, I was just basically doing some production work uh, production as in food and beverages production production work and yeah that's pretty much it then went out to meet my friends and yeah have dinner and that's pretty much it and i'm pretty tired but i on my way back on a long bus ride home <laughs> i was thinking like oh my god i could have done more in the last month i could have went out to more places and yeah sometimes I'm a little bit stubborn as well uh, I don't want to do I, wanna, I don't want to keep doing the same video and I don't want to keep saying the same thing so yeah I ended up you know staying at home lazing off and not doing anything which is totally totally bad so I need to change that in the coming months and hopefully I can make the twice the number of videos this month compared to last month so my target for this month is gonna be 24 videos yeah gonna double what I'm posting uh, last month so yeah hopefully we can make this happen 
and yeah let's see some growth growth on YouTube itself so yeah so I, after this I'm gonna put up all the all the activities that I've been doing for the past two or three weeks lazing exercising and yeah pretty much pretty much that's it so yeah hopefully I can get back gain back my confidence you know stop worrying about all the other things and start focusing on the things that I love hopefully hopefully anyway guys thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next video bye guys because today I forgot to bring my camera so all my vlogs are gonna be on this iPhone and we're going for a five jog kilometers, man. five kilometer let's go let's go man it's a fitness vlog bye all right gonna hit the pull-up bus so just finish our 5km run and we're gonna hit the pull-up bar and he got some tricks for me to learn so let's check it out all right what's that man that's like liquid um i don't know what's, what's this liquid chalk liquid chalk let's go yeah. better it's grips for better grip better grips better pull up Yeah. One more. All right. Nice. Nice. data so the reward came too fast it's not recommended though <laughs> eating supper at 3 a.m. in the morning but yeah we're into supper <laughs> that's right man that's right my hands are shaking bye bye Laksa and fishball noodle. <laughs> that looks so good over there though. Yeah, we don't really have Mm, poor baby. Mm. Mm.